Hello viewers, welcome to the inventor's thought. This one is the last video for the series cup design. Let's start with the quote that no solution is perfect. There are multiple reasons behind it. For the cup design, let's point out those reasons. First one is cup utility wise design. Cup cannot fill the drink till one's satisfaction. That is, it cannot be customized or personalized to one's need. It can be thought as a problem to be solved. Different target audience have multiple choices to use the same cup. They can use it for drinking tea, coffee or milk. When we say different target audience, it could relate to their age, gender, ethnicity, culture, their financial status, physical attributes as well. There could also be geolocation and political factor which can affect the types of cup and their design. The other reasons for the change in cup design or unsolved design problem is material used to build them. Availability of the material at native location can impact their manufacturing cost. A cup can be built using materials such as clay, silicon, glass, wood, bamboo and in some cases biodegradables. These things can affect the cost and puts constraint over the design. There are cup designs which is based on human psychology. Psychological factors which can trick the brains are color, smell, and transparency. In some cases, weather can also impact the drink habit of the user. Here is a simple brain teaser. If you can solve, please comment and subscribe for original content on design thinking. It's quiz time now. Can you find volume of water in the cup? Experiment design here is a use of tuning fork. Cups filled with known level of waters. For the hint, analyze the pictorial depiction. All the best with the experiment.